Americans may remember Smart as the maker of tiny, whimsically designed city cars that seem just slightly more substantial than a little Tyke's cozy coupe. However, the brand has undergone a dramatic transformation since its exit from the US market in 2019. Now a joint venture between Mercedes-Benz and the Chinese automotive giant Geely, Smart has shifted its focus to producing stylish crossovers. The latest model to emerge from this reinvention is the mid-size Smart No. 5, marking the brand's foray into the larger vehicle segment with its most substantial offering to date. The Smart No. 5 stands as the largest vehicle in the brand's lineup, measuring 185.2 inches in length with a 114.2-inch wheelbase, significantly larger than the compact Smart 4.2 hatchback, which was just 106.1 inches long, with a 73.7-inch wheelbase. In fact, the No. 5 is 10 inches longer than the 2025 Mini Countryman and nearly matches the Ford Mustang Mach-E in size. Equipped with cutting-edge technology, the No. 5 features a trio of sleek screens, an AI-powered voice command system, and an advanced augmented reality head-up display. The vehicle's 800-volt architecture supports rapid charging, allowing the 100.0 kWh battery to go from 10 to 80% charge in a claim 15 minutes. With an estimated range of around 350 miles, although this figure is based on China's more generous test cycle, the number 5 aims to offer impressive performance and convenience. Smart shift to an all-electric lineup began with the compact number 1 SUV, followed by the stylish number 3. Now, the number 5 adds to this evolving range, entering the competitive mid-size SUV market. It is designed to cater to those seeking a blend of comfort, advanced technology, and versatility for weekend adventures. The Smart No. 5 promises to be the largest electric SUV in Smart's range, featuring expansive tech with a sweeping 25.6-inch augmented reality head-up display and enough internal space to accommodate a king-size bed. Expected to launch in Europe early next year, the No. 5 is anticipated to be priced at over £40,000, though exact figures have yet to be confirmed. The Smart No. 5 definitely makes a statement with its more rugged design compared to its smaller siblings. Imagine a blend of the ruggedness of a Land Rover Defender, the forthcoming Vauxhall Frontera, and a touch of Mercedes luxury, and you'll get the essence of the Smart No. 5. To enhance its adventurous appeal, the No. 5 includes features such as an electric trailer hitch and roof bars. For those who want to push the outdoor theme further, Smart offers the Adventurer's Collection Package. This package adds underbody protection, a roof carrier, side steps, a side bag, and a ladder, making the No. 5 ready for serious outdoor escapades. Additionally, Smart has teamed up with various brands to provide accessories that complement the No. 5's adventurous spirit. Among these are a specially designed bike from American brand Trek and a tent from Heum Planet, a renowned German outdoor brand. In terms of size, the Smart No. 5 stands out with a length of 185.2 inches and a 114.2 inch wheelbase, a significant increase from the Smart 42 hatchback's 106.1 inch length and 73.7 inch wheelbase. It's also 10 inches longer than the 2025 Mini Countryman and almost as long as a Ford Mustang Mach E. Although Smart hasn't disclosed many specifics about the No. 5's electric powertrain, they have mentioned that it features an advanced 800-volt architecture. This allows the 100.0 kWh battery to charge from 10 to 80% in just 15 minutes. The No. 5 is reported to have a range of up to 460 miles on a full charge, though this figure is based on China's more lenient testing cycle. The Smart No. 5 was previewed earlier this year at the Beijing Auto Show, and the production model stays true to the original concept. It sports a squared-off silhouette with sleek surfacing and a robust stance. The front end is marked by a distinctive full-width light bar, and four oval auxiliary lights arranged below the Smart Badge, a design echoed in the taillights. The No. 5 also features a panoramic sunroof, frameless doors, and flush door handles. In a nod to luxury, the wheel caps float and remain upright as the wheels turn, reminiscent of a Rolls-Royce. The Smart No. 5 will be available in two trims, the Premium and the Summit Edition. The Summit Edition adds a roof-mounted light bar and an electric trailer hitch, and it can also be upgraded with the Adventurer's Collection Package for an enhanced outdoor-ready look. This package includes additional underbody protection, a roof rack, side steps, a storage compartment on the left side D-pillar, and a small ladder on the right side D-pillar. Inside, the Smart No. 5 marks a new pinnacle of luxury for the brand. It combines expected driver aids and safety features with a strong emphasis on comfort, space, and advanced technology. Rear passengers benefit from adjustable seats that allow for maximum legroom, and the flexibility extends to the seating configuration. You can fold all the seats down to create space for various bed sizes, including king size, queen size, or single, adding to the vehicle's versatility. 
Smart envisions the number 5 as not just a car but a multi-purpose space. With a built-in projector and a 21-speaker Sennheiser signature sound system, the number 5 can transform into a pop-up cinema for an immersive viewing experience. When it's time to drive, the driver is treated to a state-of-the-art cockpit, featuring a massive 25.6-inch augmented reality head-up display, a 10.3-inch driver display and two additional 13-inch screens that span the dashboard. The vehicle is equipped with a generative AI-powered assistant, capable of handling a wide range of voice commands for functions such as climate control, navigation, music, phone calls, messaging, and various vehicle settings. A charming new feature is the introduction of Leo, a lion character avatar that guides users through the infotainment system. The interior of the number 5 exudes a premium ambience with ambient lighting that highlights the door panels and center console, and glows behind the expansive dashboard screens. The two 13.0-inch displays are complemented by the 10.3-inch digital gauge cluster and the impressive 25.6-inch augmented reality head-up display. Smart's use of generative AI extends to the voice command system, which is designed to respond to nearly every query imaginable. Smart's design includes zero-gravity front seats, which can recline up to 121 degrees, contributing to the vehicle's comfort. All the seats can be folded flat to create a king-sized makeshift bed, enhancing the number 5's versatility. The luxurious interior features rich materials such as deep brown leather and oak wood trim. The ambient lighting system offers 256 color options and can pulse in sync with the music. In addition to the 20-speaker Sennheiser sound system, the number 5 comes with a built-in projector and a portable speaker that can be used outside the vehicle, making it a complete entertainment package. The Smart No. 5 will be equipped with a substantial 100 kWh battery, which Smart claims can charge from 10 to 80% in just 15 minutes. Although the official WLTP range figure for the No. 5 has not yet been released, preliminary testing using the China Light Duty Vehicle Test Cycle CLTC, indicates that it could potentially exceed 460 miles. However, given that CLTC figures are often optimistic compared to WLTP results, it's reasonable to expect the actual range to be closer to around 350 miles. In addition to its impressive battery and range capabilities, the number 5 will come with a range of driving modes designed to complement its rugged appearance. These modes include adaptive, sand, snow, mud, and rock settings, providing versatility for various driving conditions and light off-road adventures. The Smart No. 5 is set to debut in Europe at the beginning of next year, and it is anticipated that it will reach the UK around the same time. While pricing details have not yet been announced, the No. 5 is expected to be priced starting from around £40,000. This is due to its significant upgrades in both size and technology compared to the No. 3 model. Given that Smart only recently launched the number 3 and that the number 5 won't arrive until early next year, it's unlikely that we'll see any additional new models from Smart within this year. The focus for Smart will likely remain on the rollout and establishment of the number 3 and number 5 in the market.